Head off again. Oh, there we go. Hello, everyone. We are at this new cemetery. Florida girl found it. She finds the coolest places. Be sure to go over and check out her channel. It's that Florida girl. She finds the coolest places for her and I to go to. We <laughs> Sarah's with us and she has a channel and what is it Sarah? Sarah's Journey Vlog channel. There you go and don't forget about that Florida girl. We are here at and I'm going to turn and show you guys. What is it called? Wild uh, Cow. Yeah, I got to turn the camera around. I can't even see it. <laughs> it is called Wild Cow Prairie Cemetery. 1800s. Early 1800s. Early 1800s. Always remember. Okay guys, we are gonna go check out the cemetery and take you guys with us, so let's do this. Check this place out. It is right by the highway, so there's gonna be lots and lots of noise. But it's got a few, a few graves. It doesn't look like that many. It looks like a lot of military men. And it's got a flag there. I don't know what kind of flag that is. Let's go for a walk. I don't know what kind of flag that is, guys. Can you tell? Is that a Canada flag? What is that flag? I can't even tell, guys. But these look like a bunch of military men. Stefan Weeks. He is a private. Wow. It doesn't say when he died or anything. There's nothing on the back. These are definitely military guys. This is Charles, the Indian Wars. Both of these are from the Indian Wars. Then we just have an F. Let's see if there's something on the back of this one. Nope, nothing on the back of that one. Look at this. They don't have a thing, but they sure have a beautiful angel there. This is dark. Um, Dallary? Instead of Valerie, it's Dallary. I can't even read the dates. Can you guys see the dates? It's amazing. These guys are all military guys. Ooh. Look at this one. Sacred to, this is a military woman. Sacred to the memory of our mother, Anne Benton. She died in 1880 at age 57. Asleep, asleep in Jesus. Wow. Then we have, what's the name? White. Oh wait, that's, that's the last name I guess. Walks, Wikes, an infant son. Aww. He died in 1880. He, he was born in April of eight, 1880 and died in July. 33, what does it say? 33 days, 33rd, July 30, no 33rd, 23rd. I am blind as a bat, guys. Now there's one here too, and I don't know what this one is, but Oh, this is the top of it. It got broke off. 1848. And then the de death date, I don't see it. Oh, was the death date 1905? I guess the death date was 1905. This is amazing. It's a nice little 
cemetery, there's not many graves here at all. I mean, if you look around, I don't see any graves out there. This is it. There's only very few graves here. Thomas, they were all in the service. Wow. These are all military people. Oh, really? That one's unmarked. This one here, I don't know if it says something on that stone or not. They're probably just markers. It's crazy. But yeah, this is this is really tiny. What do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven. Well, this one right here might be. This might be the footstone of that one there, which probably is so, so it's only 10. Hi. Hi. So there's like 13 graves here, guys. Oh, and this is the infant son of F.L. and L. Smith. Aww. This is the infant daughter. So what was the dates on that one? <laughs> 1901, November and 20th and died December 15th, 1901. And then this one is August 12th of 1907, that died May 16th of 1908. So it didn't quite live to be a year. Oh, that would be awful to raise a child for six, seven, eight months and then it died. It'd be really terrible. Frank L. Smith, so it's, it must be, oh, so this is Frank's children. I don't know, in loving memory of Frank L. Smith, born August 14th of 1857, guys, died in 1909. I mean, this is so small. There's not much to this cemetery. Oh, that's a Florida, that's a Florida, um, I can see Florida on it now. That's a Florida flag. So I think I counted 13, 13 headstones. Now there may be some unmarked graves here. I don't know, but there's only 13 graves here. So this could be one of my flower projects. I could bring flowers here. I wish I had to just grab flowers today. I don't know why I didn't. But this is a cool one to put some flowers at. Is there a Walmart close to here? We can get some flowers. Can you GPS it? It's only 13 grays. We can go get 13 flowers. This is really neat. Do you have family here? No? Okay, guys, I am going to do spirit box here. Who do you want to do spirit box at? Do we want to do it at one of these old graves? It's going to be noisy because of the traffic. Oh, because of the traffic. That's a child. This one was 57 years old. Let's do Spirit Box right here at Ann. Ann S. Benton. Wow. She's asleep with Jesus. All right. So here we go. Okay, here we go with the spirit box, guys. Hopefully you can hear it. We are here at Ann Benton's grave, and we are trying to reach out to her right now. 
Ann, are you here with us? Somebody else. It's a baby. Thomas was in the service. Thomas, are you here with us? Crazy. They don't want to talk to us. We got nothing, guys. I mean, not one EVP that I could hear through that box. Um, I don't get it. It's so crazy. Oh, did you hear something? I thought I heard five when you said. Oh, you. So you did hear something. I heard something, but I wasn't for sure if that was that or in my head. <laughs> wow. I. It's really crazy. Let's go over here to the beginning and try to talk to. We'll try one more time, and we will try to talk to um, Mr. Smith over here. But I was getting nothing. This might be a totally peaceful cemetery. I don't feel anything it's evil or nothing like that here. I feel the, it's peaceful. Not really other than the other than the traffic, <laughs> yeah. Other than the traffic, it's peaceful. All right, so this is Frank Smith. Let's see if Frank has anything to say. But you would think if he did, he would have popped in. Oh, let me set that up. He would have popped in when we was over there. All right, so let me turn this on. Okay. Frank, are you here with us? Crazy. Not one EVP that I could hear. He must have been a big drinker. That doesn't even make sense, guys. 
not one EVP. Unless there was some faint ones that I just didn't hear because of the traffic noise. But I was hearing nothing come through. What is it? What is it that he's drinking? Is that alcohol? Yeah. Oh, that's wine. I wonder if it's homemade wine or something. No, that's not wine. Yeah. So, um, Frank Smith likes wine. He was 1857 to 1909. I wonder who's bringing, who brought it to him. Yeah. Unless it's ancestors, you know, down the line. Mr. Smith. They're all resting in peace. Really pretty great. Come into Well guys, we get anything on the spirit box. And I'm gonna listen when I get home, but I didn't hear nothing. So this is a pretty peaceful place. I didn't hear any voices. Um it, it just feels it feels very peaceful and it's beautiful here. I'm gonna go back and show you guys how pretty it is. Look at this guys. I mean there's there's woods everywhere. I mean for a long ways. And it's the trees are just gorgeous. The troops made the um, made them a sign, made that sign for the cemetery. Look at that branch that goes over. That is so pretty. So this sign here was um, voluntarily made, I guess, by the Eagle Project. Troops 439, Paxton Klein. It's really neat. All right. Well, rest in peace, everyone. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed that cemetery. I'm sorry we didn't get no spirit box, but they're resting in peace. Bye. Okay, guys, it's just so strange that I didn't get any spirit box. We didn't leave. Florida Girl is going to do some spirit box on her channel, and we are going to see if we get anything. So um, she's using her spirit box. I hope there's nothing wrong with my spirit box. But I have gotten EVPs on my spirit box before. So let's go see if she gets anything. Trying different sweet roots. Oh, sorry, right in your <laughs> face. It was right in your face. Trying different sweet rates. Okay, guys, Florida Girl did Spirit Box and she got nothing, also. I don't know. I know the Spirit Box works through radio frequency. I don't know if there's just no radio towers around here or what, but Florida Girl keeps. When I was doing Spirit Box, she thought she heard the number five when I asked the question and I didn't hear it. And then just now when she was doing spirit box, she heard the number five again when we asked how many spirits was here. Well, that's loud. So, Florida girl's hearing spirits. There must be five spirits here, but nobody's talking. Are they saying anything else to you? No. All I keep hearing in my head is like Ask them to talk to you. Nothing? Wow. That's crazy. Can you whisper in my camera? My mom's over there trying to call me. <laughs> All right, well, rest in right. peace. with us and Sarah has a small channel what's it called um hold on I'll tell you oh my god are <laughs> you kidding me it. 
It's like Sarah's Adventures or something. I can't remember. I can't believe she doesn't even know her own channel. Okay, don't judge me. <laughs> oh, Sarah's Journey Vlog channel. All right, all right, hold on. Remember that. 